Hey everyone, it's Thomas here. Today we're going to be going over how to easily batch rename files on your Mac running macOS Catalina or 10.15. Now this is an easy process uh, to complete, but there's several different options that can be confusing if you don't know what you're doing. Let's go over it. Okay, so Apple makes it pretty darn easy to batch rename files on your Mac. So the first thing we're going to need to do is find some files we want to rename. I have mine in this rename folder. Okay, so the next step to do is select all of the files you want to rename. So you can either shift click or highlight uh, all of the files you want to rename. I'm just going to quickly highlight them. Now that they're all selected, you're going to want to right click and click rename seven items or however many items you have. Now we're going to get this drop down menu with a lot of different options. So let's go over them. The first option is going to be replace text. Basically, You'll type in find, so uh, I can type in dot uh, .jpg for example, and it will select all of the dot .jpgs I have in any of my images, and I'll replace it with dot .png. Now obviously this will do a conversion, so when I click rename, it will give me a pop-up. Would you like to change the extension from jpg to png? And I will click use png. So now as you can see, Every file that I had as a .jpg changed to .png, but files that are .jpeg or .gif did not change. Okay, so the next option, let's highlight and click on rename. Um, the next option is to add text. Now this is going to add text before or after your item name. So for example, if I want to add, uh, I don't know, let's say dash image dash after my item name then as you can as you can see in the little preview right there it will show me example blah 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 dash image dash dot jpg now once I click rename all of my images are going to change to for example unnamed dash image dash dot jpg big bomb dash image dash dot jpg you can easily undo just by hitting command z like I just did okay method number three let's select our items and hit rename again uh, now this one is called format now what format will do is well we have th three options name and index name and counter name and date and um, we can type in the custom name that we want for example image and then uh, for name and index it's gonna count so if I start my numbers at 1 I'll have image 1 image 2 image 3 image 4 image 5 etc um, now if I go back format and click name and counter it's going to count uh, from 001 and up so if, if I rename uh, then obviously I have one two three and then however many images you have now to go again we can put name and date now this will put not the date that the image was downloaded but it will put the date that you renamed it so right now it's the 11th at 10:25. Obviously, I can put before or after. And when I rename it, all of my images will say 2019 11 uh, at 10:25 p.m. Uh, so that's the third method for that. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching this quick tutorial. Hope it made renaming files a little bit easier. Thanks.